of a bartender timeshare to help staff West Michigan bars dealing with the ongoing labor shortages. Fox 17's Julie Dunmire explains how it all works. West Michigan bars are having the hardest time finding bartenders to get behind the bar and do some work, but two local industry people are teaming up for a creative solution. At Eastside Billiards near the Woodland Mall, you'll find the same problem nearly every bar is facing. I've tried the, I guess the Reddit, the Facebook, the Craigslist, you know, off, offering jobs. Um, not too many uh, replies. Rich Williams owns the place. He says he needs just a little help. We're big for um, pool tournaments, so I'll know a month in advance that, hey, on this Saturday in October, we're going to have uh, a big tournament. Those tournaments bring more business than his staff can handle. I have three very solid, loyal employees that have been here for a long time, um, but they need a break. They've been busting their hump, you know, all through this COVID, um, working a lot of hours. Cue Renee Kimbrell. She knows everybody. She's noticed this problem across the board in her work as a local spirits representative. And I've developed a lot of close relationships with managers and owners, um, and my heart reaches out to them. Her heart and head, helping connect bar owners like Rich with her network of bartenders. There are establishments uh, that I work with that might be closed on a Monday or Tuesday due to lack of you know, kitchen staff, so they can't, so they can't open on their Sunday and Monday. Um, but that same person uh, might be able to work at another bar that is open Sunday and Monday. A solution started on social media. Renee has added as many bartenders and bar owners she can think of to this Facebook group. Bars can post the shifts they're desperate to cover, and bartenders and servers can pick up shifts when they might be off due to staffing shortages at their other places of work. If somebody can work at one bar or restaurant, they can probably fill in at another. Um, and it's important that being in the industry, we all help each other out uh, in times of COVID. Um, it hasn't been easy for any of us. It's not a long-term solution, but it is a way to get by for now. If it helps anybody, I'm happy, you know. Um, and like I said, I, yes, I thought about this um, to help, you know, my staff because I wasn't getting any response from ads. But if there's other bars out there and um, my bartender has Tuesday off and wants to go help somebody, that, I'm, I'm fine with that. I mean, as long as people can get through this. That's it. It's just a simple Facebook group. It's called Grand Rapids Hospitality Group. Any bartenders, servers, bar owners are invited to join, put those shifts up, and hopefully they can get covered. Reporting in Grand Rapids, Julie Dunmire, Fox 17 News. They transform